Good morning, everybody. Good morning, guys. How are you doing today? We are taking the car back to the car place because all the family comes back today. And so then tomorrow we are off to go to a game reserve. So we don't need our car anymore for the moment. But it has been really nice having a car yeah, <laughs> around here. Super nice. Um, but there's no point taking it any longer and then it just sitting at home. So yeah, tomorrow we're going to a game reserve with all the family, which is so cool. So today we're just waiting for them to all come home from their little trip that they did for their like wedding trip. I don't really know what we've got planned for today. Yeah, I'm not sure what um, we're doing today either. But I think Stephen's parents are coming down into the city to pick us up because we're dropping the car off and maybe we can go out to breakfast with them. Yeah, I think that sounds nice. That sounds have to good. convince them to come out to breakfast with us. Yeah. And then after that, I guess we'll come home, see the family and work out from there what we're doing today. But it is a really pretty day, nice blue skies and ready to see more of Cape Town. Look how colourful these streets are. <laughs> we're a bit lost returning our car, but I know. I'm happy we get to see these nice houses. I think we've almost found the place. Yeah. You turn right here, I think. Okay. Goodbye, weird, weird car. You're saying this is the worst car you ever drove, isn't it? <laughs> when we did cheap on the car, we did cheap on the car. <laughs> I would not recommend that car at all. That's got a bit lost there. We just come to Long Street and we thought we would go out for a coffee with my parents because I think we haven't kind of chilled with them yet because it's been so crazy with all the family. So we're going to find another cafe, not the one with the rack of ties, and see if we can get some good coffee because it's 10.30, I need a coffee. We're not having much luck. We're going to go down to the waterfront. Alrighty, part two of us trying to find some breakfast, some pancakes actually, which sound pretty good. So we just come to the waterfront. Oh, it's that way? So just come to the waterfront and it's pretty dead here. I don't know, maybe Cape Town just doesn't open on a Sunday or maybe they open at 11. That's my hope because it's 5 to 11. So let's go see if we can go find a cafe or a restaurant that's open for us. But the views here are so beautiful. You can see Table Mountain just behind us. Cape Town's weather has been so good to us, except for the paragliding day. We decided that there was fog on that day. <laughs> Every other day it's been so clear to go up the mountain and paraglide. Okay, I think we have some luck. There's a restaurant here, there's a bakery there. Just... Have a bakery? Yeah. I first noticed these little yellow frames on Signal Hill when we were paragliding. And they set them up all over Cape Town as like a tourism thing. And I think you get your photo in the frame and then it's got like a nice... Huh. Yeah. And then it has the coordinates of where you are. And it says what you're like That's kind of cool. <laughs> Jess, they don't do pancakes. <laughs> That's alright. We'll go for a panini then. Your dad's trying to haggle down the helicopter guys and try and get... Six for 450. Well, that's still so expensive. I wish helicopters were cheaper. Let's go inside. Yeah, this is the uh, the haggling they're wanting to do, but I'd love to do one, but they're always so expensive. Cheers, everyone. Cheers, and lovely spending time with you. I know, it looks nice. Yeah, I like it. It's all see-through. <laughs> Sorry. It's a cool car. This is Cape Town's version of the London Eye right here. Hello little fellas. Oh, come here, which one? I like this one. Pick that one up, Dan. Oh my god, they're so fast. They got faster since we last tried. They're Hello. bigger too. Hello. They're bigger now. Mm. Hey little babies. They're so cute. Hello little baby. Oh, look at them. Look how big they get though, look at the mama. Look, I'll show it in comparison. You ready? The baby and the mummy. Oh, the mummy's scared. <laughs> Go. Little babies. We've come to spend the 
afternoon at Kirsten Bush Gardens. I think that's how you say it. Kirsten it Bush. Is, Kirsten Bush is right across, like right next to Table Mountain. And when we were at lunch with Nick and Angela, they suggested we come here. And now that um, Steve's auntie is back, Auntie Nikki, she, we've taken her down here. And um, I think we're going to go and have some afternoon tea. And then they have a canopy walk, so we're going to do the canopy walk first. Come in. Yeah, uh, and we're just thinking when we were in Hawaii and we went to. Koala Ranch, Koala, yep. Koala Ranch, where yeah. they filmed Jurassic World it looks and just 51st like this. Days. It looks exactly the same as this with these big mountains. beautiful. You'll see a better view of it when we're at the canopy walk because we're actually like above the trees there and we're going to go find that too. along the canopy and it is so beautiful I didn't even know there was like rainforesty kind of areas in Africa it's so amazing hey Stevie uh -huh, it's so nice. look at that view wow so pretty and this canopy thing so cool see how you like walk above the trees so nice come for a quick snack but everything is closed literally by five minutes oh. yeah all the food Look at this. That looks good. And it's a clotted cream. The last time we had it was with Auntie Di. Now we're with Auntie Nikki. Yeah. Hello. Hello. How was Langabon? Awesome. Beautiful, good. stunning weather. It was lovely. Mm. It was just great spending time with family and on the beach. We're Stephen is currently here. eating jam with What's cheese. It was served like this to me. On a muffin. Bran muffin. It's so weird. It's actually pretty good. He served like, it like you this, would so have this from now on. Mm-hmm, no, but it's still good. Ew, <laughs> eat it. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> so every Sunday night they have like a um, a show on, like a musical show in the gardens and it's so beautiful. Auntie Nikki came here and she saw Michael Bublé, but we're just looking at who was on. And Jeremy Loops is on. Well, we would go see him because we've seen him on a few of the... Uh, Ben's vlogs and he's actually a really good musician and we were, would have come down and seen him but we're actually not in Cape Town on the 31st. We're up in South Africa at a game reserve uh, for New Year's Eve. It was just one day later we'd be in Cape Town then but the show is not on. And you just pay $15 and you go and see a show with this amazing background. We're now getting ready for a family feast. <laughs> oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Wow, I'm really in the way. Found a good album to put on while we have dinner. There we go. Well, we didn't have a barbecue, we just kind of cooked it in the kitchen. But tomorrow we're going to a game reserve, which should be fun. So we have to get up super early. Thanks to Auntie Nikki for organizing. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to a place called Aquila Game Reserve. We have to, yeah, it should be fun. We're gonna go on a game drive, lots of activities planned. But here's everyone. Does everyone wanna say goodnight? Good night. Good night. Bye guys. Tomorrow.